again, there are some sharp, sharp reactions coming from the college students that I've been talking to through the OC tonight. They say they've thought about it. You bet they have the possibility of actually being on campus in their school, in their classroom, and then there's an active shooter. And all of them saying they even thought about what they would do if they got one of those chilling texts that said, run, hide, or fight. And it's not a surprise to, to any of them, as these students have been telling me, that they've been through all the drills about an active shooter scenario, drills that they say have gone all the way back to their high school days. Listen. In high school, I remember having drills and all that. But, um, yeah, so I think, like, if that would happen here, I would just, like, run and hide. I don't think I would fight personally, just because it is a very scary thing. And also, like, we're girls, like, you know, small. Like, let's also put that into, like, thought. Like, we also have that in the back of our head. I kind of know it in my mind, but because I've been never exposed to a situation like that. So, to be honest, if, if I'm in that situation, I'll probably just panic and never think of just fighting, maybe trying to run away from the spot. That's but, the best I can do. And in our generation, it's just we've grown up learning how to, like, hide from mass shooters or school shooters all the time. So we're kind of, like, used to it. But it's like a condition thing we're used to, but it's not like we want it to happen, or if it does happen to us, we're just going to like know what to do automatically. It's just something that we're aware of. Whew, now live as you hear what she said, that might be the saddest thought in all of this that for the young generation, they've come to realize this is just a part of their life, the threat they're going to have to deal with, they're going to have to learn to live with, the possibility of an active shooter is one sophomore to one of the colleges down here told me that they've come to accept it as what they have to deal with these days because then she said it's just about being part of education in America these days. For now we're live here in the OC, back to West LA we go.